Um, does it give you some confidence knowing that if you do go down a goal zone, that you guys have proved that you can come back? Yeah, um, like I've said many times, we're capable of scoring against every team in the league, and we've shown that. So um, we've even showed that you know in games that we go behind, like against a good side like like uh, Portland, where we were two 0 down at half time, we managed to come back and get three in the second half. So um, I think no matter who we're up against, we know that even if we go a goal down, hopefully we won't. But even if we go we go a goal down, we're more than capable of getting two. Confidence is obviously a huge thing in any sport. So and you guys. Yeah, I mean, I think we've got the right to be confident after the run of games we've had, so um, I definitely think confidence isn't a problem uh, in that changing room. Trivia time, uh, you made your debut as a wee lad at 16. Do you remember who you came on for? I came on for Johnny, I away at Motherwell. Yeah, I remember that game. So. What do you remember about that moment? Like when you Came on and, uh... um, I remember it was obviously a brilliant feeling, like the last game of the season, for just for the last couple of minutes. But I remember I think I was playing in like a double XL t shirt as well, so it was hanging off me. But uh, no, it was a good experience um, and just a good day, yeah. Did he buy you a drink after the last game when he uh, was up here with you? Uh, yeah, I met up with him after the game. Um, and it was just yeah good to see him. It had been a while since um, since I'd seen him. Just spoke to him like by text and that. So it was good to see him just for a wee bit. Now that was a it was a great result uh, at home. Is there going to be any difference in, in this game coming up? Do you think it'll be a different feeling in this contest? Um, well, we it's obvious that playing away at, at their stadium is a tough place to go. But we're going to have to treat the game in in the same way that we went into the last one. Um, you know. Not necessarily take the game to them, but we're not going there to defend. We're not going there to you know sit back and wait for a counter attack. Um, you know we're going there with the intention to win in 90 minutes. If it takes longer than that, then so be it. But um, yeah, we need to take the positives that we um, that we had in that in that last game with them, and also the negatives and work on them. So um, there's plenty to take in from from the last game. Ryan, you're, you're playing away. Um, is, is there anything different when you don't have the 25,000 screaming fans that were supporting you last game? What, what's the mindset in terms, in terms of going on to enemy territory? Yeah, I mean it's always it's always better if you've got that if you've got that support um, behind you, especially that last game against Seattle when it was I think the lower part of the stadium was full, so it was brilliant. It was a great atmosphere, and um, obviously we're going to miss that um, in Kansas, but. You know we've we've got to try and get a result for all the fans that came out and pushed us on to get into the playoffs. Um, it's on us now to to try and make them happy, and you never know, bring a bring a playoff game to BC, please. Is there any banter between you and Johnny, or is there, are we, are there any we, uh, side bets? Or? Uh, no, no, I've I've not actually I've not spoke to him since um, since meeting up with him after the game. But yeah, it'll be good to see him again, and I believe he missed the last game on injury, but I think he's going to be fit for. For this weekend, so um, yeah, it'd just be good to, to face off against him again. Hopefully, he doesn't get a goal.